welcome to the CJ building. As a communication studies student, this is where you're gonna be spending the next three to four years of your life. So let's get on with the tour. Hi, I'm Leah and I'll be your guide for today. This is one of our three production studios that can be used by students who borrow equipment from the depot to make any kind of project that they might wanna do. And this room is convertible. You can use a blue background or a green screen. So the possibilities are really endless. What happens in here is all students who are doing their technical instruction, like camera setup, camera lighting, uh, learning how to use a sound recorder, it's all done in here with a group of students. It's also the perfect opportunity to actually do group work together. This is the depot. Students can borrow equipment for free for their assignments or they can ask for Mike's advice. So this is one of four uh, sound editing suites. Uh, we here teach the latest in industry standard software, specifically like Pro Tools. So our sound graduate students, when they're done, they can be ready for the workforce uh, working in the sound field. This is one of the editing suites open to students 24-7 to edit their projects. It's perfect for those late night editing sessions. These are the Intermedia Labs. Each computer is equipped with the most up-to-date softwares to keep up with everybody's creative ideas. Students work really hard in here. So this here is our biggest auditorium. It seats 100 people. For comm studies, this is as big as it gets. It's unusual for a university to have such small class sizes, but that is the defining characteristic of the communication studies. You are gonna to get to know your cohort and your cohort is gonna to get to know you. You are gonna to get to know your professor and more importantly, your professor is gonna to get to know you. This is one of the common areas in the department known as the hot dog lounge. Can you guess where it got its name? Here, students can chat in between classes, grab a snack, do some assignments, and even sometimes get a cup of coffee. So as a student here in CJ, you will be walking around noticing a lot of old Montreal signs. This is a research project by one of our professors. This is just to demonstrate that most of our professors are still working professionals. They have research projects, they have art projects, they're always still creating. And this happens to be one of the things you can see as a beautiful art gallery around the, around the building. This is the Student Association student space. It's a multi-purpose room with a friendly atmosphere, a home away from home. No, I think I'm good. <laughs> As a member of Concordia, there's a lot more to discover than just the CJ. We hope this tour has been informative for you and we look forward to seeing you in the fall. <laughs>